Two Broke Rednecks presents For four years, 1847 Rogers Brothers have been building toward the day when American dollars would begin to flow again. But today Each is not year, that the day. Has spent larger sums on advertising and sales promotion, on tools, plant equipment, appropriations far beyond what conditions seem to warrant. Yeah, the fleet of this cars was is a bit part much. Of a far-sighted plan. So the first stirrings of America's slumbering giant of purchasing power found 1847 Rogers Brothers ahead of the field. In with fact, they were at the wrong track. Goodwill and public demand. Oldest and most successful creator of finest quality silver plate, 1847 Rogers Brothers was founded by the original Rogers Brothers. Unlike those fake ones that came after. Whose high has been maintained throughout the years. With this background, 1847 Rogers Brothers was equipped to do a job and do it well when the new prosperity began. And that is the self silver plate dildo called Steely Dan. by master craftsmen was a guarantee from the past to assure the future. Did you say you could see the future? And now what the happens to me? Here. This was the time to bring out a new pattern. Not just another pattern, but something that would measure up to the bigness of the opportunity at hand. A big a pattern. pattern that's absolutely unique. Something with the appearance and also the weight and that hand wrought feeling of the finest sterling silver designs. That's gonna be a tough job. Well Glad I know I'm it is, not doing it's gonna be hard to please. Frankly, I don't know how you'll do it, but that's what we want. A new idea in silver plate. But the silver plated vagina went over selling. like a lead balloon. The same brilliant artists who designed the overwhelmingly successful first love and adoration patterns went to work on a job that was to last for months. Sadly, it took them years. Design after design was discarded. No one but an artist would reject the work that was thrown out. Only after 18 months was the final design completed. And it was but the ugly. The model was hand chased in silver and approved by the executives of the company. You're telling me Here we paid a guy for 18 months to draw a picture of this? Here was a brand new idea in silver plate. But how was the consumer going to like it? Trained research workers were detailed to interview women in every part of the country. Who all said no to the idea of silver plating their vagina. The response was Will you stop that? Nobody's silver plating anything. Working girls, debutantes, housewives, women the country over agreed. 1847 Rogers Brothers had a sensational winner. But enough about your penis to talk about silver work. And they were many. But workers because didn't want to make something that but ugly. So many firsts in silver plate. When we tackled the job of putting the new design into production, we found out we were up against problems we'd never run into before. Like, why is there this a masturbating bear in the employee's break room? And manufacturing operations that had never been used in silver plate. For then how was the, the demo made? The hollow handle knives, the two raised ornamentations on the handles of all the pieces. It meant new dyes and tools, of course. To but be made by our army of cyborgs. It meant new manufacturing methods. So we set about creating them. The first was a rolling machine. They have machines that roll yards for you now? The Where's handle. the fun in that? When the design is embossed on these two ridges, it's higher and fuller than ever before. This process is a first in silver plate. For we then know we you'll eventually bend a piece, so we did it for you. In every piece of the pattern. And this meant even in hollow handle knives. It was the first time that anyone had ever made an open work knife in silver plate. So suck it, non open a work knife makers. It's process that has only been done twice in expensive sterling patterns. But you said no one had, had ever to done make this. Outline dies to preserve the clean cut contour and delicate silhouette of our new pattern. Here was another process that had never been used before, except in making sterling flatware. And not in the cheap we shit we make. We wanted perfect balance. So we put additional weight in the handles. That gives the pieces a well-proportioned quality feel. It also allows On us to just fire a jacked up price. serving and fancy pieces with beautiful fluting and new shapes. That spoon has holes Even in it. How am I supposed to eat soup with that? And to finish. 
By the time we were ready to go into production, we had invested many, many thousands of dollars in new equipment and had added several new processes in the manufacture of silver plate. All of which the cost All is passed to you. All these characteristics, in addition to the heavy overall plating we've always used, made this the most expensive pattern we have ever produced. But you'll be glad to know that despite this, there's no additional cost to you or your customers. Liar. We had to use all of our 94 years experience in the manufacture of silver plate to meet these problems. And even but then we still had we no idea what we were doing. began to pour the metal for the first of the new pattern. Yes, experience and fine craftsmanship counted. So did and the fact last, we burnt Frank alive. Rogers brothers had a silver plate pattern which they knew would exceed the enormous success of such great patterns as First Love and, and Donkey Butt. Into the production of this new silver plate went all of the care that goes into the most expensive and most exquisite sterling silver. Many beers were Everyone involved in the entire too. 1847 Rogers Brothers organization was determined to make this the most outstanding achievement in their distinguished history. Eternally yours. It's silverware. I'm not going to marry it. For the new pattern, from hundreds which were suggested. Some of the rejected Eternally names were pieces yours. of shit and eaten utensils. When a woman reads that name on her silverware, it will bring back all the thrill, all the pride of possession that was hers when she received her set. Every piece is stamped, eternally yours. So be prepared to be buried with this crap. The name of the pattern she owns. Up to now, you could find this feature only in sterling silver. But now we put the it in all our cheap ass shit. The care and craftsmanship that have gone into its production. The sculptured design and jewel like open work make the silver sparkle like diamonds. Until you use it, then it looks like crap. Rare and exclusive sterling patterns, the pierced hollow handle knife is unique in the silver plate field. Which is why it's a bad choice the as a murder weapon. The is new in shape and gracefully tapered. Wider at the top for the finger to rest on the back. And dull as dishwater. Every feature of this new knife points up the care and expense that have gone into the creation of the whole set. Cheeseburger and X. We don't make bad movies, we make bad movies better. Thanks for watching.